All right, guys, welcome back to the channel. So I have a big announcement to let you guys in on. So a couple of weeks ago, we did get acquired by Crash Champion. So I didn't want to hold back the news from you guys any longer on the channel. So I'm going to go ahead and let you guys know and fill you guys in on this one. So I am excited about this because you guys know I've been spraying many, many years with the PPG and I've used other lines throughout my career, but I've heard a lot of good things about that 100 line from BASF. So we are gonna be switching paint and you guys are here with me this morning coming in. I wanna go ahead and unwrap this job, show you guys what's going on here at the shop. And I can't wait to show you guys a lot of the things that Crash Champions did do to improve the shop. So you guys know I love working at Mitchell Collision. My boss was awesome. But when the company came in, they really went above and beyond to try to make us feel comfortable as well as the area manager that we have, uh, JD. He did a heck of a job trying to make us feel comfortable and still coming in to try to do that as well throughout the weeks now that we have been Crash Champions. So I'm gonna walk around the shop, show you guys some of the stuff that they're doing. But I wanna ask you guys that are spraying the 100 line because now I think that we have a lot more opportunity to get this community bigger being that we have such a big, broad audience with the Crash Champions painters, you guys can help me because we are gonna be training at this shop with BASF and I did tell the guy I want to video it. That way you guys can see me as a novice and help me learn this system and you'll see it from the beginning all the way out and see how good we can get with this system. So that's one of the things that I'm really looking forward to doing is trying out that new paint line. But I want to show you guys some of the stuff that they did at the shop to make it better. All right, so check this out. And this is for the customers. They got this nice flat screen TV that's gonna be playing all kinds of stuff for them. And I'm hoping that I'm gonna be able to get some of the videos on that, but I haven't talked to anybody about it yet though. So first thing you're gonna see here is they have their sign in the office and this is still saying Mitchell's out front. So they're changing that. And the one nice feature that we are gonna be having is we are the Lux brand for Crash Champions, which means that we do the EVs, because you guys know that we do the Teslas, the Rivians, and some of the higher end vehicles. Crash Champions is getting into that market and uh, we're gonna be the shop in the area. So anybody that knows us in the area, you still got the guys here that were in this shop doing the same quality work. That's what I wanna let everyone else know out there that our workers are the same and we're gonna be still doing the jobs like we do, doing the videos like we do and doing the quality that we do because that is a big part of why we are what we are here at this shop. So all right, so the first couple of weeks I was seeing a lot of trucks pulling up and they got us stocked with more uh, parts carts from Innovative Tools. So that's going to be good. You guys know we do a lot of parts and we do a lot of parts off the car, which means that the body men need to have areas for these parts and we wanna make sure that they're in an area that they're gonna be kept safe. So now we have more of these. So that was one nice thing that they definitely did. And you guys are gonna be uh, surprised here on how nice of equipment that they got. Cause you guys know that we have a lot of high-end welders here at this shop. We have even more now that uh, Crash Champions supplied us with here at the shop. And I'm gonna show you guys some of the nice equipment from uh, ProSpot. All right, so this here is one of the units that they picked up. This is their riveting and bonding station from ProSpot. So this was a nice addition to stuff that we already had here at the shop, as well as some welders. You guys know that I don't do any of the welding here at the shop. I have done welding in the past, but that's gonna be just for the body men. And uh, we have some other stuff that they bought here as well. So all these pro spots were brought in from Crash Champions. You guys see we had the car liner stuff, but now we have all pro spot as well as the car liner. So we're set up to do any kind of repair that you guys need. And uh, we're gonna be still doing what we do. All right, so this here's our detail area. And this was here before, but it does have limited light in here. And sometimes he was having trouble seeing it, the detailer. So, they came in and they put in lighting all around this here carport. And I'll tell you what, check it out. It's really, really bright in here. And I think I'm gonna have to worry about if I leave a nib in something, he might end up seeing it now. So I don't know if that was good or bad, but he's definitely happy about it. So let me go show you guys some of the other stuff that they did. All right, so these are some of the outlets they put, but you guys see we're over here by the doors and you guys know that this is an air conditioned shop. So 
we did never have any of the automatic doors. So what we would do through the day was get somebody over here, open it up and close it down. That way we can keep the AC in because you guys know out here in Florida, that stuff will get out quick and this place will start to not be able to recover from all that. So once we told them, we had a little meeting in there and they said, if you guys know anything that you need in the shop that you think may be more efficient and make it a better shop. And we told them if you guys had the garage door openers, we wouldn't have to stop, get someone else, honk horns and get everybody in here. We could just go ahead, get in and out. Everybody could stay busy working. And right away they went ahead and said that made sense. They had the guy out here. I'll show you a little video of him measuring it up. That way he could get these things installed and we could be ready to roll here. So, all right. So I wanted to tell you guys about the purchase of uh, Mitchell Collision. And like I said, I'm looking forward to it because the more that I learn, the more I'm going to have to be able to give you guys as well. And I think we can grow together by learning more with the paintwork as well. So one of the biggest things that I had to give them a shout out for, and I'm going to show you guys the team right now in this video. that came in here and helped out with all the transfer of all the stuff when we did get purchased. And they did a phenomenal job on it. So I don't know if I've ever told you guys that I have a special needs daughter. So one of the biggest things when they were purchasing this shop was I told them, listen, I cannot have a lapse in insurance with my daughter because in case something happens, it could really be a problem for me. So when they did the transition, there was a little bit of a hiccup and they made sure that they reached out, called up the, all the higher up people that they could. And within that day, they had that insurance like they had promised me. So that was where it really showed that they cared because that was a big, big point of me. You guys know that I'm always gonna be doing videos and I'm always gonna be painting cars, but my number one concern is my family. That's why I come to this shop and I seen that they cared about it. So I'm looking forward to it and I'm looking forward from you guys helping me out now you guys are going to be teaching me how to use this hundred line so i just wanted to give you guys a heads up on what's going on here at mitchell collision it is a little sad because i miss my old boss but i think we're going to be doing a lot more here at this shop and i think we have a lot more capabilities now that we have such a big company that is really going to be growing this company and that way maybe i can come reach out to you guys at other shops and do some video at other crash champions so I hope you guys liked it. Wish me luck here at the new shop or the new owners, and I'll see you guys in the next one.